Hey guys, what's going on? It's me, Destiny Godly of thegodlyglow.com. Welcome back to my channel. It's been a little while since I've made anything here, and I'm sorry for the delay. I have been getting so many requests for lip swatch videos, so I decided to do not only like a lip swatch video, but a favorite lip combo video. Just showing you guys some of my favorite lip liner lip color and lip gloss combination. So we're gonna go ahead and jump right into the video. All right, you guys, so this is one of my favorite tips when doing lipstick, especially on dark skin, especially on nude. You're gonna wanna make sure to color correct because a lot of times around your mouth, if you don't have it naturally, sometimes the lipstick can just make around your mouth look either darker, even if you have some hair, I'm well, if you have hair on your lip and you care to get it removed, if you just so happen to have like that gray cast, kind of like how I do, then color correction is going to work. And even if you have hyperpigmentation, color correction is going to help so much. So now I'm going in with a dark brown lip liner from thegodlyglow.com and I'm taking that and I'm putting that on my lips, right? But what I want you guys to pay attention to is the detail. Please, when you are going in and you're doing your lips, make sure to pay attention to detail. There's nothing worse to me, in my opinion, than a sloppy lip with lip liner and mist spots and all types of craziness. I hate it so much. I also like to go in and blend out my lip liner because I hate a really harsh lip liner. I like it to look soft and fluffy and feathery and sexy. And when applying my lip color, the first color I'm using is Just Jazzy from jazzybaptiste.com. And it is an amazing warm nude. And I'm spreading that all over my lips and I continuously blot by pressing my lips together. Well, not really blot, but blend. Pressing my lips together to smooth out the products and then even going in with a brush to further smooth out the products. Nowhere during this routine are you to lick your lips. And I have to laugh when I say that because my mother is a lip licker. But I'm going to go in and blot off a little bit of the excess just to keep everything smooth and consistent and make sure there's an even layer of lip products all over my lips. Now this color right here is 1987, same dark liner. I do not know what happened to the footage, but I love this cool kind of cocoa chocolate mocha nude. It is so beautiful. Again, from jazzybaptiste.com. And I layered this with lip liner and then blending a little bit of gloss because sometimes with matte lipsticks, they get a little stuck. So I added a little lip gloss just so I can go in and blend everything together so it can look so smooth and creamy and effortless. It just really gives you that quote unquote porn star lip. I like the lip liner to be soft. I like my lips to look huge, honey, without overlining. And this is the technique that is going to give you that effect, honey. Yes, yeah, yeah. <laughs> we love it. Okay, so next up, I'm going in with the color 214. And this is kind of like a pale pinky nude, and this can be really scary on dark skin, baby, I promise. I'm going in with my dark red lip liner, also from thegodlyglow.com, and I'm blending that all around this lip. I generally am not a red lip liner fan, but I challenged myself to try something new, and it really paid off because I think this lip is so cute. Again, with liquid matte lipstick, sometimes they get a little stuck and I like to put a little lip gloss on top. I'm using a lip gloss from Fashion Fair, but I generally do prefer a tube lip gloss because I hate rubbing the applicator against my lips because sometimes the lipstick can move. And as you can see, I'm going in again and just layering the lip product, the gloss, and the liner. And this is just going to really help your lip to look smooth and buttery and pretty and fluffy and soft. I love lip combination, you guys know that. If you followed my original YouTube channel, youtube.com slash destinygodly, I have so many vintage lip videos over there. You guys know I love a good lip combo. And this one, it's a little new for me. I can't lie to you, I really like it. Definitely do not skip blending with a brush. It really helps to feather the product out, get it up there equal and even and consistent. And oh my God, your lips are just gonna look so sexy. 
your lips are gonna look so sexy with this routine. Maybe you already have a routine like this. Let me know what your routine is in the bottom bar. But I love this one in particular. All right, you guys, so as you can see, I covered my lip in my dark purple lip liner, thegodlyglow.com. I love this lip liner. This is a vintage red lip, honey. This is the throwback. This is the classic, honey, yes. The red that I'm using is called Trinidad, and that is from jazzybaptiste.com, and it is a beautiful blue-toned red. Both of these colors are going to make your smile look electric. Just make sure to get your lip cracks because I have very creasy lips. Oh my God, this blue toned red and this purple lip liner are going to make your teeth look blindingly white. It's gonna make your smile look beautiful. The red and the purple together look gorgeous on dark skin. This is a classic. This is a full proof lip if I've ever done one. I promise you, you're gonna love this lip. period. <laughs> we love it. Okay, you guys. So we are now going to do an orange based lip and I'm going in with a dark brown liner. I wish I had a, a warm brown liner. I used to have them. I may bring them back. I'm not sure, but this cool brown really does the trick. Blended it all over my lip first. And then I blended the orange tone, which is orange soda from Baptiste Beauty, jazzybaptiste.com through the center of my lip. I never really put color in the corner of my lips because that lip liner really just helps that area of your lip to recede and it's so sexy. It's gonna make the center of your lips look huge and fluffy and full and big and healthy and lush and then it's gonna make those corners just sink back and your lips are just going to pop off your face. When you do your lips like this, and then you look at your profile, baby. Otherworldly, absolutely gorgeous. Everything used in this video will be linked in the bottom bar. I hope you enjoyed these lip combinations. Which one was your favorite? All right, you guys, so go ahead and subscribe, like this video. Remember, it's the Godly Glow. It's the glow for me, thegodlyglow.com.